Hi everyone, Tom from X-Ray Tech here. And today I'm gonna to show you how you can automatically summarize all of your long emails with AI and no-code tools. We'll start with a quick overview of how it all works. Then I'll give you a detailed step-by-step -step instruction so that you can build it yourself. If you'd like to learn more workflow automation and AI tips, be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for new content every single week. Now let's get started. The automation consists of three simple steps. First, we send any email we want to summarize to this customized Zapier inbox. That triggers the automation to run. Then, the automation sends a prompt to OpenAI for a summary of the email. Finally, we can send the resulting summary to Slack, another email, or anywhere else we'd like to get the output. Here is how it runs when it's finished. We forward an email to the Zapier inbox. Wait just a moment. and we get the summary directly back. Now let's take a look at building this automation step by step. First, create a new Zap and choose Email by Zapier as the trigger. Using Email by Zapier will allow you to trigger the automation immediately whenever you forward an email. If you use Gmail or Outlook as the trigger, you'll have to wait five to 15 minutes for the automation to actually start. But we don't build automations with AI tools because we want to wait. So you'll select Email by Zapier as the app for your trigger and New Inbound Email as the event. Now you can create a Zapier inbox where you'll forward any email you want to summarize. Give the inbox a name like Summarize Bot and copy the address to your clipboard. Send an email to the address and test the trigger. Next, add a new action to the automation and select OpenAI as the app. Choose Send Prompt as the event, and you'll need an OpenAI account with a payment method on file to use this step. If you don't have one, go to openai.com, click on API, and then click on Sign Up and create a new account. Click on your profile in the top right corner and select Manage Account. Click on settings on the left menu to get your org ID. And under billing, you can add a credit card and set hard and soft usage limits. While you will get charged for using OpenAI's API, the rates are really reasonable. At X-Ray, we only burn through about five or $15 a month, and we've been using it quite a bit. To connect your OpenAI account to Zapier, click on API keys under user on the left side of the screen. Create a new secret key and copy it for Zapier. Note that sending prompts through the Zapier integration will incur a charge on your OpenAI account. That's why knowing the soft and hard limits are really helpful. The charges probably won't amount to much, but if you wanna avoid getting charged during your testing and building of this automation, I'd recommend testing out the prompt that you want to use directly through ChatGPT instead. Once you've crafted a prompt that you like, you can paste it into Zapier and use it every time the automation runs. For our prompt, we'll stick with something simple. Briefly summarize the following email, make a bulleted list of any action items required by the email. Then we'll insert the body of the email retrieved from the trigger. Now we'll test the step to get the output. Finally, you just need to add one more step that will send your summary wherever you'd like it to go. For this tutorial, we'll just send the summary as an email back to the original sender. Add a new action and pick the email app that you use, like Gmail or Outlook, or even choose Send Email by Zapier as the action. Then fill out the necessary fields to compose your email. We'll set the to address as the address of the original sender from the trigger, then we'll add the AI-generated summary into the body of the email. When we test the step, we can see that the summary is in our inbox. AI is quickly becoming an extremely useful tool to speed up anyone's workflows, and it's more accessible than ever. By combining a platform like OpenAI with no-code tools like Zapier, you can tear through a bloated inbox in a matter of minutes. 
If you've enjoyed this video, like and subscribe for more automation and AI tips every single week. If you'd like to learn more about no-code and low-code automation, follow us on LinkedIn, Twitter, or Facebook, and you can find all of our content on our website at xray.tech. You can find all those links in the description down below, and as always, don't forget, keep the flow.